I'm back, <laughs> kind of, I'm trying to be back. I'm trying to film a get ready with me so I can catch up and tell you guys what I've been doing, why I've been a lazy POS and haven't been recording. I mean, there's no really reason, but I just wanted to basically catch up with the people who care. I have not posted a video in a long time, and I think like the last video I posted, real video I posted was where I'm like, I'm back. What do you, oh, uh, by back, do you mean not posting again for six months? Is that what back means? Apparently. So I decided to get on it. Me, in the flesh, through your computer screen. I have a lot of new makeup here that I've never tried before. It's not like a full face first impression. I guess we'll just catch up and see uh, what I've been doing. <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> still awkward. Okay, so I'm gonna start off with Sem Primer. I have not used this step one in a hot minute. I, have, I just realized like the other day I was organizing my makeup and I realized I have so much freaking makeup and like I had to throw so much of it away because it had gone bad which is like really terrible. Also, something you may have noticed is I have extensions. My hair is crazy as ever. This part weighs it down, but I still get like fluff on the top. It's hilarious. So yeah, I have extensions now. They're very, very, very long. And I have these smart tabs, which I'll just show you guys because people might wanna know. So I have smart tabs. Can you see that thing? It's like a little tab of hair that wraps around your hair. And I just have them placed all over. So, this is my real hair, and then my fake hair goes longer. But if you have any questions, I think I'm gonna be doing an extension video, so I'm just saying. I don't think I'm gonna do a crazy eye look, so I think I'm gonna do my foundation first. This is the Lee Swatier Velvet Matte Foundation Oil Free, and it comes in one of these little droppers, like that, and so I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna add in a tiny bit of this Note Sun Glow Foundation, so it's not so matte. I, I'm not a matte girl, I'm not a matte girl. Anyways, what have I been up to? Oh, and I'm gonna be using this e.l.f. foundation brush. I got this like maybe three months ago. It's the swirl foundation brush, so it has that little swirly thing. Uh, so I've just been living my best life, you know? I have been really busy with work, and that's part of the reason why I actually have not been posting. I just got really busy and slash lazy. You know, I really wish that I would have been on it more because I miss it, but I, it just got really overwhelming to think about posting because I just felt like, I don't know, I just felt like I didn't have anything to offer for some reason. I just felt like I wasn't going anywhere with it. And I kept telling myself, you know, once I get a new camera, then I'll hit it hard. Like that's, I'll go for it. I'll post all the time, blah, blah, blah. Guess who got a camera? and didn't do anything. Ding, ding, you got it, me. Uh, so back in July, I think, is when I got my new camera. I got a Canon 80D, which I'm obsessed with it. So I'm really liking this combination. Um, I feel like there's good coverage. Uh, it's, I mean, I'm not sure about the brush. It's all right. I feel like it's a little stiff but it's also a really affordable foundation brush. I, I am actually, now that I'm looking at it, it looks really good. And I like the finish of it. I definitely think I'm glad that I, I put this Sun Glow foundation into it. By the way, this has SPF in it. This is the color 10. Um, I like it because it gives it a little glow and I on my hand, when I was mixing it, I could tell that the foundation was really, really, really matte. I'm gonna move on to eyes. I'm not gonna do concealer yet because I might need to clean it up. I'm just gonna take the bronzer from the Becca Chrissy palette here that I just got and I'm gonna use that for my crease color. Um, anyways, what I was saying was I did get a new camera, uh, the Canon 80D. I'm loving it. I've been taking lots of pictures, but I haven't really done any video. Yeah, I need to get on it. I figure like, you know, it's hard to have the attitude of like, who cares how many views it is, even though I think that's really what you should do because, uh, you know, it, it can't be about that or else you're going to be miserable because if it doesn't work out, you know, I see on Twitter all the time and I get it. People whose livelihood is YouTube, they're upset because you know the algorithm I, I can't focus on that which is what I've been doing I'm like man if these people can't get views on their video who are like really good this is what they do for a job how am I supposed to get views on my video so I just kind of psyched myself out with that and um haven't really done anything wow it's re this this foundation completely dries down like there's even though it has a little shimmer to it because of that uh sun glow it is very matte, like it's completely dried down. So another thing that I got, it's a, uh, I think it's like a Swedish brand or something because it is in a different language. It's called I Done Minerals. I got this at Nigel's, but you can order it on Amazon. 
And this is what it looks like. It's a really pretty, it's got a little apple in it. I'm gonna use this uh, along with a couple other things. But the first thing that I'm gonna do is take this brown color and smoke out my crease. If another thing that probably since I have been back on here is that I have made some really, really good girlfriends. Um, you know, from beauty stuff. I've always been friends with these girls. I've known them for a long time, but you know, just ever since uh, Gen Beauty in January here in LA, we just got really close. We just have been, we talk to each other every day. It's so funny, you know, whenever we see people or we talk to people, people are like, oh, it's so funny, you guys, it's so crazy that you guys are such good friends in real life. Like, that's awesome. And it's true. We are, you know, we're really, really close. It's not, you know, for Instagram or anything like that. It's, it's a real friendship. We have a really fun group text. And so I'll link those girls below. They're all my girls, so I love them so much. Um, I like this eyeshadow. It's really just very easy to blend. I'm just, I'm using the same brush too. I just picked it up and I'm just kind of smoking out my crease with it. I think I'm gonna do something kind of fall today. And I'm just gonna pick up this uh, Urban Decay Fluffy blending brush and I'm just gonna kind of give it a nice blend through. Uh, if you're here and you're watching this, please just uh, engage with me in the comments because I wanna know that people, well, I wanna know what people care about. You know, I wanna like have fun and just not take this too seriously and just have fun with makeup. So I'm gonna finish that eye, the top of the eye, with a new pigment I got from Inglot. Oh my God, these Inglot. I almost have all of these now, these like really super sparkly ones. They are so freaking pretty. So this is number 24. It's a really pretty bronze color. Look at that, oh my God, these things are so rich and sparkly. I'm gonna take this Pixie Glow Mist. I like to use these pigments wet. Oh, this is so sparkly. I might've actually got this too wet, but we'll see. Oh my God, it's like, it's like molten lava or something. <gasps> it's so sparkly. I'm dying. I love it. I love it so much. <gasps> Deceased. I have no words. I have no words. Like I literally have no words. That does not happen often. I think these are like the most sparkly eyeshadows I've ever had. Uh, and technically they're pigments, so. So now I work on the HGTV show again, House Hunters Renovation. I used to work there. If you follow me for a while, you know I worked there for like two years. So I went to the challenge and then I, now I'm back. I've been there since February. So, um, so that happened. I feel like, again, these are things that you guys didn't know. Yeah, I, I'm back at my old job, which is really, really fun and happy. I love that job. So this is like my secret weapon concealer. This is the Sonia Kashuk Undercover Liquid Concealer. I'm obsessed with it. I just love the coverage. I think it's really, really pretty. It's very full coverage and smooth. And then I'm using my Moda brushes, little, uh, this is I think a contour brush technically, but I like it for under my eyes. It, it stopped at 30, I think. Why did you, I was peeing, I heard you say he's a very rude boy. <laughs> I was talking about you. Please. And then I heard your fart. In what way? I said, I'm still with my boyfriend. No, because I haven't posted a video in a really long time. But then I don't think it recorded, so it doesn't even matter. I don't think your fart recorded either. But I could hear it through the freaking wall. You sicko. I think it just cut off a lot of my filming. I think it stopped at like 30 minutes and it was at 40 minutes, so I was really just talking to myself in here. No big deal. Either look at that gold eyeshadow. I'm here for it. I'm here for the glow. Why am I doing this? I have no idea. This is how long I have not filmed for. I just like, I'm putting mascara on and I haven't done my bottom lashes. I like a smoky under eye. Oh, that just adds. That just adds. So let me do my lips first. Um, I'm gonna be using this Milani, Milani, um, Milani liquid lip in the color Devotion with the NYX lip liner. This is the waterproof one and this is in dark red. Obviously like we're all kind of doing the same thing. I don't, I really, really want to try not to review products that everybody else is reviewing. I just feel like there are so many of the same products coming out. Like everybody, like the product, one product comes out and there's like a thousand reviews and I get it. We all have different like perspectives, but I just feel like it's like how many freaking reviews of one product can you see? Oh, this is definitely not as dark as I thought thought it was gonna be. Mm. This dries down a tiny bit patchy. Like I kind of have to, okay, but like where did my lashes go? Did they fall out? Like actually, I think I'm not gonna put lashes on. I feel like this is kind of fun and fall. I don't need to put lashes on. 
Anyways, I really hope that you enjoyed catching up with me. I don't know if a ton of you made it to the end of this video. I just kind of wanted to chat, do a video. I didn't want to just like post a video and for people to be like, oh, this is weird. Are you doing videos again? I kind of just wanted to do a chatty video. Get ready with me. I'm going to film another video after this. I'm going to try really hard to do better. Okay? Try it really hard. We're going to see how we can do it. Um, it's not that easy. No, it is. It's It doesn't matter. There's no excuse. Okay? I'm just talking myself at this at this point. There's no excuse to not be um, posting videos more. So I'm going to be really trying. I just really would love your input. And um, for me, a comment means way more to me than a view. If I had 100 views and 100 comments, I would be like the happiest person in the world. And I guess I should say like the YouTube stuff. If you haven't subscribed, press the red button. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. Um... Oh yeah, let me know if you want to see any hair tutorials now that I got hair. <laughs> um, okay, well, love you, mean it, peace out. If you enjoyed this, do the whole thumbs up thing, and we will talk very soon. I think that's it. Thanks, guys.